hi hi guys hi besties welcome to the new vlog today is saturday <laughs> today is saturday guys i have like a dinner to attend with my friends so i'm on my way out this is saturday night um dinner is by 8 30 and this is almost 8 and i want to get going but anyways this is what we would like to break there this is what i'm putting on um this top is from pretty little thing then i have the jeans from zara then shoes are from mango and my bag is from YSL and that's it i'm running late that's why i'm like rushing and i'm trying to like talk fast and yeah i'll see you guys when i get back from my dinner or i don't know i'll see you guys very soon <laughs> So exhausted and i'm so hungry see i already removed this um listen today was hell for me outside it's so cold my hands were freezing i want to get gloves i think it's high time i get gloves because i cannot count anymore see i look like a mess like i look like a school girl anyways <laughs> i know that if i remove this wig i am not coming back to the camera I know so let me just say everything I want to say then remove my wig then eat then relax then do assignments then sleep then get ready for school tomorrow again yeah so I'm about to do something crazy today I am about to upload my civil wedding pictures yes your girl is married <laughs> what a way to break the news <laughs> Yeah, you guys married. Um, where do I start from? Where do I start from? Where do I start from? <laughs> yeah, so today is um, today is eighth of November, and I got married on eighth of August, and it was one of the best days of my life. We had our civil wedding. Um, just so you know, yeah, what's it gonna have our traditional wedding? What's it gonna have our white wedding? If I don't do trad, you guys have met my mother, right? Good. If I don't do trad, just know that <laughs> my mother will kill me. <laughs> because literally, she keeps saying that traditional wedding is literally just for her and the family. I'm married for three months and <laughs> I've been enjoying my marriage, okay? <laughs> guys, I don't know why I'm blushing. I don't know why I'm blushing for you guys. <laughs> I've been enjoying my marriage. I I don't know. I've been enjoying the privacy. I've just been enjoying everything. Um, but I think I'm ready. I haven't uh, I haven't posted it yet on IG. I'm about to. Okay, just come here to tell you guys that I'm about to post this. By the time you guys watch this video, obviously it'll be on a Sunday, and yeah, you shall see everything. So yeah, I've been married for three months, and I've I've been loving it. Okay, I don't know why. I think just feel like posting it on social media immediately happened i just i don't know i just wanted to um take my time enjoy myself enjoy my marriage enjoy my husband enjoy everything then like okay i was not like okay now i'm ready it's been three months i mean let's post <laughs> don't expect the traditional wedding or the white wedding anytime soon because i'm in school and i don't think i can combine school and planning a wedding a civil wedding was so small when i mean so small i mean 
two close friends from my side two close friends from his side and that was it that was how small it was like literally i told all my friends like they all knew that they weren't going to post or anything because i told them that i wasn't ready yet um to let everyone know so it was a very very it was a very beautiful day for me and for my friends and for my family oh my brothers were also there yeah my brothers were there plus two close friends from my side two close friends from his side and after that after we finished from cuts we all had lunch at a restaurant in lagos and that was it oh yeah it was in lagos and that was the end of the day it was it was private it was beautiful i had a very good time like i was surrounded with like my people i did vlog that day guys i did vlog it's more like a private personal vlog just for myself my husband my family and my friends yeah but the traditional wedding i'm it's gonna be public i'm gonna upload that one the white wedding too is also going to be public i'm gonna upload that one i just feel like the civil wedding was i don't know more of me i want a garden wedding it's always been my dream to have like a garden wedding so like a very small beautiful garden wedding um white wedding yeah honestly guys most of the time i always forget that i'm a married woman i won't even lie to you it just always feels like we are still dating myself and mike like that's just how it always feels like and i love it like that's how i've always wanted to be like we're like best friends so it feels like he's still my boyfriend and i'm still his girlfriend and that's just the way it has been um as you guys have established i'm a very private person i let you guys know things that i want you guys to know so please don't be mad at me that i didn't tell you guys this on time okay i just like i said i just wanted to have these three months for myself and now you guys know <laughs> that's it uh let me go and eat because i'm starving hi guys good morning today's saturday guys i have been battling with one assignment like that and uh, the deadline is on wednesday and today's saturday so i have like how many more days to go i don't know i've just been battling with this but i know that at the end of the day i'll get it right and i'll submit on wednesday but i've not been able to sleep well because of just this particular assignment like it has been on my head and i've been cracking my head <laughs> trying to figure it out but yeah let's let me take a break from that and let me face you guys good morning guys guys i did braids um yesterday i went to peckham peckham is a place in london obviously <laughs> and yeah because so many people recommended peckham that's good to peckham and do my hair blah blah, blah. it's cheaper there and it's not as expensive as like the instagram stylist so guys i did my hair yesterday i didn't vlog it because yesterday i wasn't in the mood i was just so pissed off that yesterday the weather was annoying because it was raining throughout yesterday and there was also like a railway strike so everything everything just added to my mood and i was like ah oh, i beg please but yeah i feel better today as you can see i've been battling with assignment like i said before but yeah I just did like very simple knotless braids because I'm tired of <laughs> wearing wigs and I just want to like pack something and always go to school like fast fast just pack my hair and go to class rather than looking for one wig to wear or the other wig to wear so like, I'm glad I did it guys today I'm so excited I am finally going to start work on this second room which is my own personal space like I can't wait I already bought everything they've delivered it they delivered it yesterday i'll show you guys and the person that's coming to set it up is coming this morning by 10 a.m um which is very annoying because i'm not yet done with my assignment <laughs> and i just wanted today to just be for my assignment alone but he's going to come he's going to set up the wardrobes and everything and i'm going to organize that place guys that place is looking like a mess if i show you guys that place that place is as chaotic as my brain this morning me trying to figure out this assignment <laughs> that's exactly how that place looks like but i'm so glad like i'm so glad i'm finally going to get it sorted out i'm finally going to organize it i bought several things for it i bought a table i bought a chair i bought a mirror and other things yeah so the guy is going to help me set it up today but first i need to go and like remove the things that are there because that place is so messy it's so disorganized it's so chaotic so i want to just go and free it up so that he can have enough space to like walk inside so then you guys should pray for me with this assignment because honestly this is like the first assignment that's ever ever challenged me literally challenged everybody because we had to beg the lecturer to give us like a sample 
of the people that did it last year like the guys that did their own last year we begged them to give us like a sample copy so that we can actually see what we are supposed to do because it, the, the assignment really challenged everybody in class and finally he gave us a sample copy as at yesterday and still with the sample copy i'm still trying to figure it out but <laughs> But don't worry guys i'll be fine i'm also filming with my phone my camera is down so i'm charging it so i'm using this iphone 14 and i don't think the quality is that bad i have never i don't vlog with my phone like never but for me to use this iphone 14 it means that okay quality is okay <laughs> now ah <laughs> see guys you see these things here i asked the landlord if they could come and remove them for me because obviously i don't need it if i'm going to install my own because today i want to install my own and he was like no it can't be removed that this is the way it's going to be and i shouldn't touch it <laughs> uh it was so sad because like even when the guy comes now to install my own wardrobe system that i designed guys oh yeah i designed it on ikea so the one that i designed is coming today to install it everything is already outside like they delivered it yesterday so even if it comes today to install it now these two things will still be here which is kind of good and bad it's good because it's like an extra storage for me so i have like another extra storage here and i have another extra storage here but it's bad because it's messing up with the plan that i had for this space which is what is annoying and this thing again look at this can you guys see this thing yeah so this thing is going to be behind the wardrobe system that they're going to install here and i just pray that at the end of the day it makes sense um i just hope because i need my i need storage like i need my space i'm just thinking i imagine if this is somebody's room like this is somebody's actual room that the person is sleeping so this is the person's wardrobe this and this that's the end that's all Plus, the room is now small again. Like, where would the person put extra things? I don't imagine myself putting things here alone and here alone. All my things can never enter here and here. I don't think anybody's things can never enter here and here. Like, it's just weird the way they build their houses here. Like, it's so small. <laughs> like, what is this? Like, what is this? Anyways, I'm just going to wait for the guy to come. I'm going to go and continue my assignment till the guy gets here guys let me give you guys updates the guy is around but he went downstairs to um, repack his car um yeah but so far so good it looks good so far so good this is what he has done he's not done okay he's not done so here like this i was able to get this in between this two um whatever this thing is called since i couldn't remove it i just put my own in and this is another side too and this is not blocking this you can still open here and have access to the extra storage that this thing is providing since my landlord said that i can't remove it but this is what it looks like and he's not done when he's done i'll show you guys what it looks like like the end product but yeah i really really like it already so like i said i was the one that designed all these things guys on ikea because ikea has like this studio kind of thing where you can like des design your own like what you want and all so here where my hangers would be and i put this double one like yeah so i think i'm gonna put my bags and shoes this area and my clothes this area but yeah we're still gonna organize obviously when i'm done but this is it halfway through he's not yet done like i said something is still gonna be here that's his toolbox over there 
um, I'm still gonna have something here. I finally have a space where I can be keeping my camera when I come in here. Yeah. <laughs> you guys can tell that I'm excited. <laughs> See, update on my assignment. I finally found a breakthrough and I've been working on it since. I called one of my classmates and she explained like everything I needed to know. So I'm happy because um, it's coming together, like the assignment is coming together and this is one course that I love. It's economics, it's an economics course and I don't want to fail it. So I have to do what I can do. So yeah, guys, look at the way this thing looks from here. Hey, Yama has a closet. Yama has a closet. <laughs> See, I've not had my bathroom. I've just been moving around this house. So I'm going to leave you guys now. I'm going to let him work. I couldn't vlog him working because I asked him if I could vlog and he said no, he's shy and blah blah blah, you know. You're gonna take permission from people to feature them inside your videos. So I asked him and he said no, so sorry guys. <laughs> he doesn't want to be seen in public. <laughs> Hi guys, he just finished. And let me show you guys what this place is looking like. First of all, the sun that is coming in right now is driving me nuts it's so sunny today the day i decide not to go out the sun will come out but when it's time for me to go out everywhere will be so gloomy and but yeah let me show you guys also the brightness of this clip is going to be like fluctuating like going up and down up and down because of the sun keeps coming out and going back in so anyways let me show you guys the final look of this place and some things that i can't really change that is out of my power that is kind of annoying me but it still looks good okay so, uh you guys have seen this place already um i just put hangers there okay so now okay guys so let me explain why this small space is here <laughs> i feel like a carpenter right now so i took the measurement on ikea like their studio they have like only 100 centimeter width which is this one this is 100 centimeter and they have 50 centimeter and i think they also have 110 centimeter and you also have 75 centimeter there about i think so so um this is the only one that could fit into this space so 100 plus 50 is 150 so from here to here is 150 so this was the only one that could fit into here and here perfectly and leave a space any other thing i was going to get let's say i got um um 110 centimeter and i got 50 centimeter it's going to overlap so it's going to be like reaching stopping here which doesn't make sense because of this thing here so any other thing i would have gotten would overlap and reach here so i couldn't i was like okay it's better i find one that can fit into these spaces like perfectly than finding one that will overlap and it will now start coming out do you guys get what i'm trying to say that's why this space is here so now i don't know what to do with this space and the way this space is here is just annoying because i'm a perfectionist and i wanted it to like be up to here so there's really nothing i can do about it i can't even put boxes inside here i was planning on putting all those small small traveling boxes now put them inside but there's nothing i can literally if you guys have suggestions <laughs> of what i can do with this tiny space here let me know but i doubt or let's just leave it like this because it still looks good this way like nothing spoiled you guys agree yeah? like nothing nothing spoiled at all it still looks very nice attractive and all it's just that me i'll be looking at this i can't even hide somebody inside here like this <laughs> look at this corner guys see the sun is out again so now i have to adjust this brightness again oh god this is what i'm going to be going through now guys this corner i love it okay this is like my dressing table um, i'm gonna put all my makeup skin skincare and everything here makeup and blah 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 and here i think i want to get like a very cute flower vase and just decorate this place for me and i love this mirror i love it you guys can see everything this is like half body mirror you guys can see me yeah yeah so now moving over to this mirror okay this is full body mirror but i think the mistake that i made was getting a different color and not getting black because as you guys can see this color is um beige or whatever and this color is black so it's just making it look kind of weird or maybe it's just my eyes but it still fits so yeah yes i do have two mirrors in this room because i'm a mirror freak and i love to look at myself one and two this is like full body mirror as you guys can see you can see like the whole fit so whenever i want to do like ootd i could always come here and give you guys like 
the full thing and this one is like half okay for makeup for doing my makeup because this is obviously where i'm gonna sit down get a chair here sit down here and you know do my makeup and all that but this one is we've established what this one is for so yeah i think the only mistake that i made was getting a different color I don't, I don't know what to do because I can't return it. Obviously, I've bought stuff from the box already. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh, yeah, I think I know what I was thinking. I was thinking that this mirror, this one, this black, I, I don't know, the way it was in the picture, I thought like you won't be able to see the color of this thing. Like it was very thin. I don't know how to explain it, guys. <laughs> like this thing was so thin that you won't even know it's black. That was the way it was showing. On their website so i just felt oh it's going to be like um just this round mirror and the black is going to be like so tiny so thin see that's the only explanation for this error that i made but for now guys i don't know what to do about this color but i don't think it's that bad i still like it uh maybe i'll just end up painting this black we are gonna get like spray paint or something and just paint around it and paint it black so that it can flow because as you guys can see what this room is giving it's giving black and white see i got black hangers intentionally so that i could just um fit my aesthetics and what i'm trying to achieve with this room so apart from that hmm, it looks good to me looks good as you see the way this one is up and down up and down it's so annoying like pick a struggle Ah, London weather, Jesus. So I don't think I'm going to organize in this vlog because number one, I still have assignments to finish and number two, I still have things to do today and I don't want to get into the organization yet. So probably in my next vlog, um, this room would have been organized. I would have put everything. Probably I'll do a TikTok for it because I do want to do a TikTok for it. Yeah, by the time I upload my next video, this room would have been organized. But I don't think I'm going to do it now, guys. I'm sorry. I have to go because I haven't even started editing this vlog at all. I haven't. So I need to do that tomorrow. No, I have a time to, but I need to finish my assignment today. Then make dinner. Then after making dinner continue my assignments the other assignments i have because i have two so i want to try and finish one now then tomorrow <laughs> you guys already know that i i edit a day before i upload like <laughs> it's normal now i don't know i can't help it anymore i edit a day before i upload so just know that i always edit on saturdays to upload on sundays so tomorrow i'll end up editing and i also organize this place tomorrow and that's going to be the clip you'll see in my next video but yeah uh thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in my next video bye